Can you name the video game by their in-game doors? That's Metroid Prime, yeah. Second one, that looks like Halo to me. Third one, I'm gonna be honest, I got no idea. <laughs> I have no idea what this one is. The next one, a key going into a big door. I've seen this before. Is it Banjo-Kazooie? Hold on. That's Kong, it's a rare game. Bad for day. That's a rare game, man. Um, oh, I, dude, so many of these are coming back to me. I don't know this one yet, but just give me some time, okay? That's probably like an Elder Scrolls. This this looks very familiar. Just take a stab at it. That's Final Fantasy. <laughs> Recognize that brickwork anywhere. Now this, dude, I got, is it Kingdom Hearts? Let's go, okay. Now we're talking. Now this, I'm looking at this, my brain's going... N64, PlayStation 1, game with a lot of doors. So I'm thinking to myself, it's Resident Evil. It's just psychology. This, I'm like, man, that's that's like a PC game from the mid-1990s. Is it? I'm just going to type Elder Scrolls 2. Is that Morrowind? Is it Oblivion? Is it Daggerfall? Is that Age of... Is that Warcraft 2? Let's go! That's close enough! Close enough! Send it! Okay. This, I've got to be honest, I have actually no idea. This looks like it's on the Game Boy Advance to me, but I, I don't know what it is. Um, and this, I really... Dude, that looks like the Twilight Princess color palette to me. This is kind of driving me crazy. Donkey Kong 64. Banjo Tooie. Nuts and Bolts. No, I came later. Diddy Kong Racing. Okay, that, that explains why there's a deep memory. This one, I feel like this is a trap. Like, um, is it mist? <laughs> I'm dying here, dude. I don't even, this doesn't even look like a freaking door. Dude, that must be Shadow of the Colossus. No, it's got the same palette. Oh, it's, it's, uh, Ico. It's, it's one of those, the last guardian of the temple. It's like that, dude. It's one of those, dude. It's one of, you know as well as I do, it's one of those games. Devil May Cry. Let's go. This is the only one. This is, this is a Game Boy Advance or a SNES game. The door itself makes me think that this is an RPG. It's Golden Sun. Did I already type that? It's Final Fantasy. It's Dragon Quest. It's a big door. It's Wario Land. It's Chrono Trigger. I looked at chat. It's Chrono Trigger. It's not Chrono Trigger. It's Paper Mario. Was that the Game Boy Advance, or is that DS? That's from GameCube? Why does it look so bad, dude? Can you name the anime from an image of a single character from it? I don't see how I couldn't. This is Naruto. Kakashi Yatake, of course. This is Attack on Titan, because he's got the thing on his, on his belt. That's Full Metal Alchemist. Yeah, that's Edward Elric. That's Gurren Lagann. I don't know what that is. Is that Inu Yasha? I don't know what that is. Okay, next. Next. That is One Piece. One Piece! Easiest one of my life. That's Catherine. Is, this, this is Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> ah, yeah, 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 yeah. It's Cowboy Bebop. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, come on, it's Dragon Ball, man. Z. Make them harder. This is too easy. That is Naruto. That's uh, Avatar. That's Boruto. Okay, hold on. Yeah, dude. Digital monsters. Digimon are the champions. Come on. Okay, here we go. Dude, we're going to get more than 50% here. Dragon Ball. <laughs> Three more. I know this guy. That's from Hunter x Hunter. That's Gone Frex. Oh, shh. Oh, this is my hero academia. That's uh, Kingdom Hearts. That's Sword Art Online, dude. Okay, so check this out. That's Samurai Champloo. That's Demon Slayer. This is just a guy. It's just a guy living his real life. Sword Art Online. My hero academia. I, against every, every impulse of my body is telling me to glance at chat. I will not. My school is haunted. You are from Death Note. You are from Boruto. 
You are from Inuyasha. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Death Note? Yeah! It's like, it looks like Indie Mouse. Okay. Okay, one more, one more. Evangelion. Neon Genesis Evangelion. Neon Genesis Evangelion. Neon Genesis Evangelion. Um, you're My Hero Academia! <laughs> uh, Tokyo Bridge. Demon Lords. Samurai. Pineapples. Come on, you got 20 seconds. Pretty messed up because this guy's from Beyblades. Sorry, I give up. Soul Eater! I was gonna say Soul Eater. Average score 70. Code Gase. Of course, that's Lelouch Lamp Rouge. Everybody, I think, was familiar with that. FLCL. I honestly thought that was like a program you downloaded to make beats. Could have been worse, though. All things considered, could have been worse. All right, so I want to react to Dan doing his names for Generation 2 Pokemon, because Gen 1 Pokemon was so much fun. Um, but first, I have to prove how few or how many Gen 2 Pokemon I even know. I never played Gold and Silver. Um, I was too cool for Pokemon by then. 15 years later, I played Pokemon Go. I was no longer too cool for Pokemon. In fact, I'm not sure at this point if I'm even cool enough for, for Pokemon. But anyway, we got 20 minutes for 100 Pokemon. Let's get this started. So I know that this is Chikorita. She evolves into, I'm just going to be honest with you, I have absolutely no clue. I have never seen this before in my life. This is Torchic. <laughs> this is Tor... This is Cyndaquil! And Cyndaquil evolves into an angry ferret. That is Totodile. I know Totodile. He evolves... It's like the art... They put so much effort into the art for the phase one. Then phase two, they're like, nobody's ever going to care about this guy. Look, he's got teeth popping out like this. And then this... I have no idea. Never... That's a Digimon. That is not a Pokemon. You... I know you. You... He shows up in, in Pokemon Go. He just shows up and he goes like, It's my turn to use the Xbox. But I don't remember... I don't remember his name. You start with an F. I think you're like Free Luma or something. Hoot. Hoot. I know it! <laughs> oh, okay, hold on. You're Breloom? No. Breloom. Okay, here we go, here we go. Pichu. Clahorny? Togepi! The legend. <laughs> I have no idea. Pokety? Yeah, yeah, you are... You're a sex pest. You're flashing. What are you doing? You weirdo. You are Mudkips. What? What? Whoop? Whooper? Whooper! <laughs> Wamba. Yeah, I know you. You you evolve into a cool bird. I like a bird with a hat. Oh, what the heck was your name? Crow. Crow Brim. Slow King has logged on. Girog. <laughs> I know you. Mega Man. Slugma. <laughs> and then the grown-up version, Bofa. Hat Rack. Oh, Flame Hound. <laughs> um, fire, it's the fire dog. Houndoor. Houndoor. Seedra. Kingdra. Okay, oh, I don't know where that came from. S Fanfy. Fampy? Fampy! Really, Nintendo? <laughs> I know you. I know you. And it's not just because of the birthday cake. I think you start with an S. Antler? Stantler? I know you. You're Hitmon up? <laughs> Hitmon... Top! Aren't you Hitmon top? H Hitmon top? Oh, well, that suggests the existence of a Hitmon bottom. But I think the Hitmon bottom might be Stantler. I give up, man. 23 out of 100. That's all I got. 23 out of 100. <laughs> Who the hell is 
is this, man? Who the heck is this? Yes, yeah, Mark Zuckerberg? I am, was often cited as the most trusted man in America. <laughs> Michael Jordan. Okay, is this is this guy? Yeah, yeah. I co-founded Wikipedia. That's Jimbo Wales, baby. Two-time Prime Minister of Pakistan. Gonna be honest, I don't think it's Roger Federer. I was the first emperor of the Roman Empire. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and guess again. This is probably not Sigma Freud or Paul McCartney. Or <laughs> it's just like let's not even get into it. Um, I'm pretty sure you must be Augustus then. Okay. Ah, the central figure of Christianity? I'm pretty sure that that is Michael Jordan. Two-time Prime Minister of Pakistan, four Oscars, Tour de France. Okay, well, I hate to say it, Tour de France, Pakistan Prime Minister, four Oscars. Oh, baby. I, I can't lose, man. I can't lose. Okay, I can lose. I'm about to lose. I had an infamous rivalry with a co-star and was the first person to accrue 10 Academy Award nominations for my acting. You look like you could hold a grudge. That's all I'm saying. I created a 1947 US television program starring a famous puppet. I'm gonna be honest, this guy looks like a puppeteer. Something in my head is saying, you're the prime minister of Israel and your name was like, <laughs> oh my, oh my gold ear? Goldemir! Hey! <laughs> I told you something like that. Infamous rivalry with the... I'm telling you, she could hold a grudge. Betty Davis. Okay. Unofficial political leader loved by the common people. Ava Peron. All right, dude. I didn't think we could do it. I didn't think we could do it. Country by toilet. I can tell you, I see Japan, but I also see Japan. So I'm going to assume this is Japan and this is South Korea. Straight up, I think this might be in downtown Vancouver. One, one of these two is in downtown Vancouver, I think. This one scares the crap out of me. This, I, I'm predicting this is Scotland. This seems like a farmer who loves to look out onto the, the rolling highlands. So he set up his toilet like open air concept. South Africa Safari Lodge. Many options here. I choose to pass for now. UK? I don't know why this one strikes me as being British for some reason. <laughs> USA? No, that, I mean, come on, that's gotta be America. I don't know. Oh, Germany at the Hard Rock Cafe. Okay, so that's, that'll be that then. India at the Tixi Monastery. Many possible options here as well. I don't know. <laughs> I'm like, this one is so good. It looks like, the oh, it's a beauty pageant probably, but I don't know why it looks like someone's getting married next to a golden toilet. Okay, so this is probably Dubai. It's a toilet made of gold. Public toilet by Hundertwasser. This could be New Zealand. I know I said it was Scotland. What? That's horrible. Okay, Japan. Finland dry toilet. This looks finished to me. Doesn't this look like a dry toilet? This looks like a dry toilet to me. Like, I don't know, you scoop some mulch in it after? France public toilet. This says toilet. Okay, that's easy. This kind of looks like a British bathroom to me, man. But this kind of, that's UK design, okay? So now that I, oh, it is a British toilet. Oh my God. USA. There you go. Okay. Process of elimination. Okay, Switzerland. I'm going Alp Synergy again. Oh, okay, Peru. This could be Peru. This, these could all be Peru. Two minutes remain. Which one is the floor toilet? Oh, it's gotta be China. Okay. India at the monastery. I kind of feel like this is the monastery. He's, he's cracked. Now, one of these is a South African safari lodge. The other one is South America. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and say that the safari lodge caters to tourists and thus would have glass. 87%. Oh, baby. We only... I can't believe that we got these two wrong. I mean, I get that this was done by an artist, but, like, this is horrible. I... This artist... Come on, man. Get, like, get into NFTs or something. Stop making subway bathrooms. That's, that's horrible. I hate it.